So, Walker, Texas Ranger versus Michael Myers. Oh, wait. Wait, that's, that's not right. What's going on, folks, and welcome to another reputized video. Silent Rage is directed by Michael Miller and stars Chuck Norris. That's right, Walker, Texas Ranger himself. He goes up against this genetically enhanced psycho killer that has been pumped with these drugs to make him superhuman. Yeah, he's got a little bit of a fight on his hands. Now, this movie came out back in 1982, and I gotta say, it was weird. A lot of it made me laugh. It was, it was one of those violent, happy-go-lucky movies that you just come across what I mean by that. When Chuck Norris fights, he's got the moves. It's, it's fun watching him beat the crap out of someone. But those scenes, I don't know if it was because of the camera work or the, the technology back then, but it sounded so funny. All you heard was grunts. If you close your eyes, all you hear is... <clears throat> it's just so funny. Unlike most movies nowadays, you have a score within the fight scenes. But in this movie... The score just goes completely dead throughout the whole scenes. <laughs> that was that was kind of hilarious. I found myself laughing at a lot of that. The cinematography and the lighting and all of that, it, it was done pretty well for a 1980s movie. Chuck Norris, as always, he delivered. For those of you who watched Walker, Texas Ranger like I did, you do see a lot of that in this movie, even though this movie came out before that show started. And a lot of this movie, I noticed, there's similarities to the original Halloween in this movie. Halloween had just come out prior to this, and I don't know if that's what's inspired Silent Rage, but there's a bunch of shots in this movie where it was a one-angle shot. How it starts, like the first five minutes of it, it's just one shot. There's no cuts, cutaways, there's no nothing. I think there's like either one or two scenes, I think there's only one scene, where you actually get to see out of the killer's view. Ring any bells? <laughs> so yeah, I, I think they nudged a lot to, to Halloween in this. Mainly the original one. But Silent Rage, it was good. The positives, it was a good Chuck Norris movie. You get to see him whoop ass, go up against biker gangs, and plus you get this genetically enhanced psycho killer, which makes it even more challenging for him, for someone like him. And I, I thought that was pretty interesting to see. And like I did in my intro, it was kind of like seeing Walker, Texas Ranger up against Michael Myers, but a really poor imitation, only without the mask. And plus he runs. The negatives in it, it, I wouldn't really consider them negatives because I kept, I found myself laughing most throughout most of it. But the score, they tr they tried to make it dark, and it was in some scenes. But when they started fighting and doing all this crazy stuff, it was mainly in the fighting scenes when I found myself laughing. It was cheesy, but it was fun. It was so cheesy and it was so dumb that it was fun. That rhymed. I classify this as one of my favorites just because of those scenes and the characters. They were okay. Some of the actors in there I felt overreacted. One girl was being chased by the killer in the house. She was screaming and the, the way she delivered it, it just seemed like she was trying too hard. I don't know. <laughs> my final thoughts on this movie, it was decent. It was, it was good for for something to do on a rainy day or something like that. There wasn't no, nothing else to pop in. You know, you can, you can watch this on a rainy day and just be entertained and enjoy what Chuck, Chuck Norris brings to this project. I'm going to give Silent Rage a C. I still liked it. Hell, I just bought it. Like I said, it wasn't bad. I'm not degrading it. It was a good, fun film to just pop in and watch on a rainy day. Thank you so much guys for watching. I really do appreciate it for those of you who did. Like, subscribe, and get reputized. If you like this video, please share. What did you think of Silent Rage? 
were, were your opinions the same as mine? Or did you have a different aspect than what I did? Leave your comments down below, and I look forward to hearing from you. Look forward to more reviews coming soon. Peace to Rembrandt.